Hey Pythoneers, in this video, we'll go through two fundamental algorithms for searching through data structures, ones you must know to level up your Python skills. Let's start with the binary search. Binary search is an efficient algorithm to find an element index in a sorted array. Here's how it works. Given a sorted array and a target we look for, we create a function with the array and target as input. Then we start with two pointers, left and right, where we assign start of array and end of array. We run a loop while left is less than or equal to right, Calculate the middle index mid by taking the sum of left and right and dividing it by two. If the middle element is the target, return its index. If the target is greater than the middle element, search the right half by saying left is now mid plus one. If the target is less, search the left half. We say right is now mid minus one. Repeat until the element is found or the pointers cross. If the element not present, return negus one. When we run this, we see the target is at index two. When we check this, we see it's true. That's binary search. Okay. Now let's switch over to the linear search. To find the index of a target value inside a list of numbers in Python, we can use a linear search algorithm. Let's build this. We define a function called linear search, where we pass a list and a target. In the first version, I'll show you how to find the first index. Therefore, we loop through each index of the past list from the range of zero to the list's length minus one. Then we check if the value at index i of the list equals the target. If so, we return the index. Otherwise, we return minus one to indicate that we didn't find the value. When we now run this and print it to the console, we see in the first round that we found the target value at index zero. This only gives us the first index where we find the target value. With a small change, we can find all values that match the target value. And here's how. We simply add an empty list, for example, called indices. And at the point where we returned the index, we append the index to the indices list. Then we change the return to say, if there's a value in indices, we return it. Otherwise, we return minus one. When we run this again, we get a full list of all indices where the value matches the target value. With just a few lines, we created our own linear search algorithm in Python. This is a simple but inefficient search method for large datasets compared to binary search. It works with both sorted and unsorted lists, unlike binary search, which requires sorting. And that's it, no magic, just two powerful and essential search algorithm in Python.